boys, I hope you're ready for an insane day. <laughs> What more can you ask for? I, I can't think of anything. I don't need a fish. Bro, I've had the best sunrise of my life. Seeing riding whales. in a wild track. <laughs> There's a whale, and honestly, that distance is like 10, 15 meters. That's ridiculous, actually, bro. Terrifying if you ask me. Is that a whale? That's the real question. <laughs> Why is it so close, man? <laughs> Take the time. Have a nice liquor cup of coffee. Carl special. You know, I wait oh. for the sun to come up a bit for the viz. And we're ready, boys. Jump in yeah. the sink, eh? Yeah, it'll jump in the sink. Oh, how's the vehicle? I can't wait to have one of these. Honestly, frothing right now. Just arrived on the hike still. So we hike. We're gonna go to either that point or that point. We're gonna see now. Frothing. <laughs> Can't wait to film this video, bro. This is so nice. Yeah, it's unreal. Like, think about it. That's insane view. So if you're ever in the bush and you need like a lip ice or something or a moisturizer of some sort. First thing I can think of is this Olivera. I think it's called Olivera. This is even if you have a little sore on your leg, you see? Take that. Okay. <whistles> My lips are gonna be soft now. <laughs> if you don't have any lip ice and you're out in the bush, your lips start cracking, that's the perfect stuff to use. <laughs> it's only 7.30. And I think this could be our best video ever. Like, it's... <laughs> Boys, I'm frothy. <laughs> if you're lucky, we might find some octopus here in the little gullies. They normally sit like stagnant in the water. Yeah. Gonna grab it. Man, make up a little bit of calamari. Oh, yeah. Should be good. At the moment, conditions are all prime, eh? Yeah? Jimmy, very dreamy. Absolutely frothing, it looks really good. It smells like... 0.9 meters which is nothing wind is like three kilometers an hour and the verse is perfect honestly dreamy it's the second day in a, in a row we've dived i'm a bit knackered bro yeah to be honest <laughs> yeah. anyway i think we find a perfect little campsite for today let's go check it out boys i found a flipping perfect spot for us to camp to. oh check this is out. prime what uh, this is not easy. <laughs> that's insane oh a little cave i feel like a coinman what? No, Bro. <laughs> the whales are just over here. Bro, whales just in front of us. Look here, in a, the perfect cave. Genuinely, I think it's going to be the best day of our life, bro. Josh, bro, I think, I think we're safe to say this is definitely the Filthy Bunch headquarters here. For sure, bro. I reckon, yeah, boy, Filthy yeah. Bunch headquarters. Definitely. Oh, bro, it looks insane. Bro, as my dad always said, you have to always walk the territory. <laughs> Ignore him. Bro, this is insane. I can't believe how good this is. Wait. I'm frothing at the moment. Okay, so we just arrived at Faulty Bunch headquarters. <laughs> so we want to go explore a bit. But before we do that, we're going to set up a little on the, the Faulty Bunch uh, gas cooker. We're going to set up some coffee. So we get that brewing quickly. There we go. Oh, oh! So, way to show when you're hiking and stuff like that, that no one doesn't know where you are. First thing you can do is fold these wherever you go. So by doing this, like this physically can't be built by nature. So by doing this, let someone know that there is someone here or there was someone here previously. And if they're looking for you in a survival situation, any bit of information helps. So, if you can when you're hiking, we don't need to because we know where you are. 
but in general, if you don't play with parents or anything like that, you go hiking, make sure you do these. Try and get it lacquer. And for the fun of it, just try and get as still as you can. Yeah! That's prime. It's honestly so hot. Stay hydrated, boys and girls. There you go, boys. Lucky for the boys. Yo, check that, bro. Whale's literally coming so close. Check that. Oh, wow. That's so close, bro. You're literally going to dive with him today. So we honestly diving like off here to the end of the cult and I swear there's a whale right here bro. Yeah. What? Yeah. <laughs> what? Yeah. yeah bro! That's insane and there's another one like over here. I reckon they're definitely feeding bro. Yeah. Hopefully I'm not on the menu. <laughs> <laughs> Is it Chris? Oh! oh. You can see the ground! Yo, I'm fronting, bro! <laughs> yes! <laughs> oh my word! Boys, just suit it up quick. I think we're quite ready. Honestly, being the best morning ever, I'm ready to make it the best day ever. Like, uh, <laughs> Yes! I'm frothing. Oh, I'm frothing so much. Do a backflip! I'm still gonna send it. I'm still gonna send it. <laughs> Oh, it's a decent one, eh? Yeah, not bad. Look bigger in the water, to be honest. <laughs> but I'm so crude, eh? Hey, just a little gully to you. Yeah, I saw it, bro. I heard this shot, I was like, where's the hook? <laughs> I was following it, and as I was following it, it started like weaving like this. And then I kept going, like, because I couldn't get a shot, and it, as, as it turned, it went <laughs> right through it, bro. Yes, boys. Take Insane. What are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> That's a nice one, dude. That's a big RT, bro. That's a big one, eh? Where'd you go? Sure. <laughs> bro, That's a big RT. Lekker, <laughs> man. Bro, I was chasing you, man. I saw it. I said just no. There we go, you know what it is. <laughs> Kettle's already done, she's screaming baby. Gonna make some coffee now. But firstly, most insane dive we've ever had. Like For undoubtedly. Sure, really. It was so oh, unreal. Yeah. Like we were frothing. Um, I wanna know what this fish is, we don't really know yet. We'll find out, but it was pretty big. Look at it, it's 
Got the same mask as like a bear star thing. I don't know, it's quite hectic. So yeah, anyway, pretty stoked. Got a new species and two decent fish. We all stoked. Gonna make some lack of fish sandwiches again. You know how these fish sangers. <laughs> the water started getting a bit cold, but I think this is probably our new best spot there. Eh? Boys are stoked, boys are frothing. Oh, so thanks to the ocean for giving us what we got there. Eh? Oh, unreal, mate. Looking good. Butterfish. Nice boys, you ready to feast? I'm just gonna fill it quickly. There you go guys. Now to the filleting of this fish. I'll let you know what the name of it is eventually. Calvin's little kitchen? Yeah. We are boys. Okay, you start high up in the head. You wanna make sure you don't lose too much. I've never filleted this fish before. It's clean. Should be good. Wow. Wow, that's honestly why you guys Yo. need a good knife, bro. Whoa, the meat on that, eh? White, eh? Clean. Sheesh. Okay. So pretty much whenever you fill it, it's a go-to. So you lift up. You want to lift up the pectoral fin. Get under it, behind these bottom fins. Once you're through, make a slit across the top. Make sure you have a clean knife. Then you come through here, you are fresh. There you go. Just like that. There we go. Sure, check it out. Over there. Wow. Let me clean that quick. Jeez, bro. Look at huh? that. That's white. Bro, are you a chef? I, I think so, bro. Oh, okay. Cool. Filthy bunch kitchen. Okay, first you want to take the rib bones out, like this, around. Ramsey, is that you, bro? I think so. Okay, we're gonna lift up the ribs. Obviously, the more and more you do it, the better you get. But at first, see, there's ribs. Done. Come on, you, you, it doesn't get better than this. No, that's right. Okay, and I do a uh, skin of fish. So you come like that. Once you do that, put your finger, do that so you can put your finger there. Like this. It's like that, that skin off. What I prefer is like filleting and all that, um, and cutting fish at the water. Reason being, you can throw all this back in. So none of it goes to waste. You eat that, the crabs and octopus eat the rest. Yo, wait, do you guys want to hit the first rest? All of this I'm keeping for the dog. Dog will frost on this chicken. Oh shit. So it's like uh what we're gonna do is make some fish hangers, but not your normal fish hangers. We're gonna make some toast fish hangers. Yeah. <laughs> Say no more. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome. <awesome. laughs> That's awesome. This cocktail, yeah? Yeah, honestly, what else do you want? Fish cocktail. You want anything else? Just tell me and I'm gonna catch it for you quickly. This is gonna start with the unknown fish. Oh wow. Honestly. The basics. Right there. Oh, oh, that's not great. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. wow. No, this fish is what? Oh it smells gorgeous. Yeah, it actually smells ridiculous. Oh, oh, look at that! Yes, man. Not more. Yeah. Looking good, bro. Definitely. Like delicate this meat is. Oh. Oh wow. Stop look falling good. off, man. This is actually ridiculous. Look at that. What? It's crazy. Okay. Okay. Hello. That's a butterfish. No, this is all that other much. Stuff. What the hell? So that's all from look your fish. Look how That's crazy. That's a shitload. That's of a shitload of meat. Oh, I'm. That's <laughs> right. Go for it. What did that you was. just say? Wow. 
Can you bring a nice little piece here? Oh wow, look at this. I'm trying to pick it up, but look at that colour. Check it out. It's unreal. It's genuinely ridiculous. Does it taste different like, to any fish? Or? Bro, it's like a proper fish. Mm. Like you bite it and it's got like texture. It's not like mush. Mm. Like it's, bro, I'm definitely sure more that taste. Ah. Not fish at all. Yo, it's not bad. Not my favorite fish, I'm not gonna lie. No, but it's not bad. But bro. it has a much different taste to all the other fish we caught. Yeah. Right? As a breeder, I always want to try this. What is that? Fish we caught. I, bro, I still don't know what fish it is. But it's f***ing decent, bro. Yeah, yeah, you don't mind. Shot, G. <laughs> yeah, it's right first then. Bro, it's so good. That is really nice. I like don't like even it's, know what fish it is. I don't know, I still don't know what fish it is. Like, it's so good. Amazing, man. Dude, that's delicious. Yo. Now we just put pretty much put the unknown fish in here on the toast. Oh, it's looking <laughs> incredible. <laughs> no, I'm frothing for this. Let me just. This is at least one bite. Yeah. Woo. Mm. That looks incredible, eh? <laughs> Yo, don't say a word. Stop yeah. it. <laughs> this is ridiculous. Let me go. Let me go. Mm. This is crazy, bro. <laughs> the filthiest, <laughs> honestly. Yeah. <laughs> I almost want to say it's the best fish I've ever had. Obviously not tuna and shit like that. Or yellowtail, but what we've caught is the best fish I've ever had. Mm. This is ridiculous, bro. It's done uh, wow, that fish was insane. Like genuinely, next time shooting at least two of those we need that in the freezer that will be prime but we're speaking now and we're thinking like everything we got today it's worth so much like not even the memories and like talking about the actual fish like the the stuff we got back and it's all for free we just had to go gather go gather it and go collect it but obviously you need your license and that you guys make sure you do it legally but anyway, I hope you guys are stoked. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, like, subscribe, leave a comment, let us know what you want. And if you liked it, this is, we honestly think it's going to be our best video ever. So anyway, let us know your thoughts. Cheers.